Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom on the Sinclair ZX Spectrum. Um, I had this back in the day on my Amstrad CPC 464. Right, push Kempston. And I didn't really like it that much. And I just played the Commodore 64 version. I didn't really like that version either. And this version looks like got ported to the CPC because graphically everything about it looks pretty much the same ah oh, fuck's sake so what we got to do on this level is go around saving the children oh fuck's sake I think you get um, I think you get about five lives and oh fuck so because I fell I lost a life Right, here we go. Oh, come on! So I didn't see him up there. Game over already. Let's have another go. As that only lasted about a minute. Well, not even a minute. So, all we got is our whip. Uh, it says when I was looking at World of Spectrum this it said there was a um, a 1 to 8k version I've got it on 1 to 8k mode but I cannot get the one I can't well, I don't know if there was a 1 to 8k mode oh what's happened I got fucking hit by something I don't like the way it scrolls because if you go too far up the screen there might be a guard there yeah. Seven kids, gotta find seven kids now. Then I've oh, oh fuck's sake. Then I've got to then I think it goes to the the cart scene. The mining cart scene. Oh fucking hell Bubsy said and I lose a life. Ah oh, this is bollocks. Whip the guards, yeah. I'm whipping the guards. Oh, there's a kid down there. Oh, come on! Fuck off! Game over already. I couldn't get very far on the CPC version either. But I did it first time on the Commodore 64. Got off this level. But I think it was easier. At least on the CPC version, at least you got music. Oh fuck! Even though the music rendition was pretty crap. Oh come on, I'll push fire! I'm not like, I don't like this. Well, US Gold, what do you expect? I don't think I played a decent US Gold version, a decent US Gold game on the Spectrum, especially the Amstrad. Actually, there was a few that did slap the net, like Gauntlet. But that was programmed by Gremlin Graphics, released by US Gold. There was some that, that got a good version. Desert Fox was another good game. A fucking push fire! Oh, I'm not liking this. Bloody hell, I'm not, I don't like this game. See? Like the films, films are absolutely fucking fantastic. Especially the original trilogy. Um, the Crystal Skull, it was alright, it weren't as good. Oh god, I got... Should have gave it to Ocean Software, I think. Maybe they would have done a better job. 
No, US Gold got the license. See, you can only stun the fucking guards. You can't. You can't kill them. Oh god! Oh, luckily that was a little fall. Alright, down here. Just don't like the way this scrolls because you could get too far to the end and the guard could come on. Oh, fuck off! I've had enough of this. Um, don't like it. I really don't like it. I'm just thinking why. I gave the Amstrad version 5 out of 10 because that should have been a lot lower I don't know I think I was a bit more lenient with my scores back then but no if I if I reviewed it on the CPC again I'll definitely give it a lower score than that because I think it did play worse on the CPC than it did on the Spectrum um, I just didn't like it on the CPC um, I think this is a little bit faster which you expect but no I just don't like this game I really don't like it anyway I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time and goodbye.